Scott, where are you from? Jamaica, Jamaica, Jamaica. Jamaica, a Caribbean island that is home to 2.9 million people. There's been so much talk regarding the similarities between Ghana and Jamaica, but is there any real truth to it? Hi guys, welcome back. Okay, today we are talking all things Ghana and Jamaica because you know what? Since I've been in Ghana, I've heard nothing but comparisons as to how close Ghana is to Jamaica. And I want to know the truth because right now, I've got Scott with me. And Scott is Jamaica. You, were you born in Jamaica? I was born in Jamaica, yes. See, how long were you there for? I was, I left Jamaica at the age of 24. Oh, so, so they, oh, yeah, that's oh, right. oh, okay. So you can tell me, you, you probably know Jamaica more than I know Ghana then, oh, in that case. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so what I want to know is, like, you have a taste of both worlds, because you've been in Ghana on and off yes. for a little while, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay, so tell me, what do you, what are the comparisons can you clearly see between like Ghana and Jamaica? Do they look, okay, does it look the same? It is the same. Uh -huh. It looks the same, feel the same. Uh -huh. There are differences, okay. but you can identify the two different. Okay. You know, but the comparison, the weather, you know, the people, you know, they forget the language, yeah. but for the people and everything they do is the same thing we do in Jamaica. Just the uh, same thing, which is really nice, you know. Uh -huh. it's, it's just make like for me now in Ghana, I'm at home. I don't miss Jamaica, I'm in Jamaica. You right. understand? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. So okay. This, so this one is. Okay. So like the, the like the corner shops are the same as like how we have here. Because when yeah. we say shops in the UK, yeah. you expect like bricks and you know it's all yeah. done fancy with yeah. flat lights and all of that. Yeah. But here we have like you know. Um, Container shop, yes. and that's the shop. It's the same. You got a little stall, uh -huh. you know, a few boards. You, you make it up yourself. Yeah, yeah, you know yeah. what I mean? Knock, knock, yeah, knock, knock, yeah, knock. Yeah. Yes, there's my shop. Exactly. <laughs> you know what I mean? You got your few can of mackerel or sardines uh -huh. Uh -huh. or a little whatever. It's, that's your shop. Right. You know, you sat out there in front of it all day, or sometimes you don't even see it. It's in front of your house, and you're on the veranda watching it yeah. from a distance. You know? That's the same thing here. Right. It's the same. It's not nothing fancy. Right. Especially for like the poorer people, you know, who is less fortunate, you yeah. know, yeah, financially. Okay, so like, if you were to go to sleep tonight, right, yeah. and I was to transport you to Jamaica and yeah. you woke up in the morning, you wouldn't know it's a difference. I would know. The only reason why I would know <laughs> because I know when I'm in Jamaica, I'm in Jamaica. Okay. Okay. I wake up. Yes, I feel the heat. You know, mm. you may hear the the cup grows. Yeah. You know what I mean? You can say yes. I'm in the Caribbean or I'm in Africa. Yeah. So yeah, you will know. Okay. Yeah, it's how you got a big difference. Okay. Yeah, okay. that way. Okay, so what like major differences do you see between the two? Wow, that's a aim. Wow. I'm putting you in the hot seat yeah, now. Yeah, no, I know because like no, <laughs> people I gotta, are waiting. I, I, I'm on. gonna have to think now. Why? What's the major difference? <laughs> yeah. Oh, is there one? There might not be. How would I put it? How would I put it? Because I would say both countries are developing really fast. Yeah. You know, as you can see, there's loads of building structure going up. Yeah. You know, so I would say that's a comparison. But difference. Oh, jeez. Oh, it's a, it's a tough one. It's a tough one. Your wife is doing sign language behind the camera <laughs> to tell you. What are you saying there? She's saying people. She's saying like. I think the people are very different. The people? Yeah. Okay. The youths. Right. Yes. Ah, uh -huh. so I found uh -huh. something. I should say the people. Yeah. It's the youths. The youths are different, you know, because uh, like it's 2021 now. You know, what it used to be like when I was a youth is, is so different. These youths are on a faster pace. Oh. Everybody wants to make that money quick, want to become superstar. Da, 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 da. Yeah. So their vision of, you know, getting there is, is more different. I, I think based on what I'm seeing in Ghana, the youths, they seem to be laid back. Most youths I see on the streets, you know, trying to hustle yeah. and stuff like that. I don't really get to see that out there. They're yeah, more here yeah, on the computer trying to, you know what I mean, do everything else really. Okay, so you're saying that like Ghana seems to be more laid back, whereas yeah. Jamaica people are. Yeah, a bit trying to faster. move faster, yeah, faster pace. Right. That's what it is. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So do you have hawkers there, like how we have here? Yeah. So people like selling at the roadside and you stuff get, like you that. You get that, you get that. You know, but the thing is you only can do that in certain areas. You know, like in the cities where you got like the tourists, yeah. you can't really do that. They don't allow you to do that. You have to have specially licensed boat to sell at certain venues. But like in the normal street, like you go through, yeah. you know, anywhere, like Spintex or wherever you see people yeah. with thing, you get that. You okay. get in certain areas where people go through the street, knocking on your door, trying to sell you stuff yeah, and everything yeah, like yeah. that. Yeah. 
Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah so it's, it's, it's no difference. You know, if, if you get a chance to travel to Ghana or to Jamaica, then you will see mm. that only difference is the language barrier. Yeah. You know, you know, in Jamaica we speak Patwa. Yeah. Patwa, you know what I mean? Mm. And in Ghana, I guess they speak some Pidgin English yeah, sometimes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And three and you know, all these mm -hmm. other languages. So, yeah, that's what it is, really. Okay. So tell me about the food. Because I know there are some similarities. Like when yeah. I look at wache yeah. and I look at rice and rice and peas, right? Yeah. Like they look the same. It is the same. It is the same. It's just prepared different. Yeah. We like to have our, our red beans, you know, kidney beans, whole. While yeah. wache is a bit more broken up in pieces. Yes. You know, yeah. so and that's the difference really. And yeah. we had we had coconut milk to our rice and peas. Yeah. I don't think they put that in wache. No, no, they no. have other like I think there's I can't remember the name of it, but I seen like a, a the herbs are different, like a the spice they put in yeah, it. Yeah, there's that. Flavor. I can't remember what it's called. There's this red thing that yeah, they put yeah, in yeah. to give the color. Yeah, I can't remember right. what, it's, yeah. what it's called. So that's what I mean. But it's the same rice and peas. But yeah. I think when the slave were left Ghana yeah. and got to Jamaica, mm -hmm. they couldn't get all those ingredients that they yeah. put in. You understand? <laughs> so so yeah, yeah, we got to yeah. make do with yeah. okay, coconut. That's great. Yeah, 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 and that's yeah, what yeah. it is. Ah, yeah. It's the same. That does make sense. Okay, breadfruit. Oh, my wife is saying about breadfruit. I don't think we have. breadfruit? I don't, I don't know. I, am I embarrassing myself now? I no, don't know. no, no, no. In Ghana, they don't eat breadfruit. So when we went to Ebri and saw all the breadfruit on the tree, we were quite surprised. But in Jamaica, they eat breadfruit. Yes. What, what is so, that? So breadfruit, um, it's it's large fruit. It's green uh -huh. on the outside. When you cut it open, it's like a, a creamish white inside. Okay. But it's it's um, one of the dishes that is famous in Jamaica. So if you eat ackee and sawfish, yeah. you got roast breadfruit. You know, so when it's roast, it's like a bread. So that's why it's called breadfruit. Okay. So even though it, it's a fruit, it doesn't taste like a fruit sweet right. or anything. It's just a savory. You have to add something to it to make it taste palatable. I think like... So do you have to cook it or you can just eat it straight? You, no, no, you can't eat it straight. Oh, you okay. have to cook it. Either you roast it, then you fry it or you okay. boil it. Okay. And then you have that with you, ackee and sawfish, you can have that with you, your mackerel rundown, or your stew chicken or curry chicken, mm -hmm. you know, those things yeah, go well yeah, there. Yeah, yeah. Or even anything, anything you choose. Like, I love jerk chicken, right? Yes. I love it. And like, it's so hard to find here. Like, it's only really like, if you go to a Jamaican restaurant that you'll get the jerk chicken. Like, I haven't really seen it. No, you, you know what? For, for you know, I didn't even want, I didn't even want to mention that. You know, I won't I won't I won't call the restaurant name for uh -huh. whatever reason. Uh -huh. But I I've never been to a, a Jamaican restaurant in Ghana. Yeah. So my thing is, I wanted to go experience yeah. the Jamaican culture in Africa. Uh -huh. And I went to that restaurant and I was really hundred and fifty percent disappointed. Really? Yes. I don't know. If, if, hey guys, don't cuss me out no. for this. I'm, I'm being honest. No, come and, um, on, why? And the reason why I'm, I'm, ex I'm emphasizing on this is because I used to be a chef. Okay? I don't go around telling people I've been a chef for you 10 are, years. You are still a chef, you're yeah. just not practicing. Yeah, I don't practice uh -huh, it anymore, right. but I've studied it, worked for 10 years as a, as a cook, as a chef. Uh -huh. Okay? I went there and I ordered jerk chicken yeah. and rice and peas. Yeah, yeah. I'll give them thumbs up. The rice and peas was almost there, but yeah. the jerk chicken was really not jerk chicken. I'm really? sorry. I'm sorry. No, I felt disappointed because um, I was hoping to get that, you know what I mean, that yeah, feeling. Yeah. You know, I love the, the Ghanaian delicacy. I love their meals. You know what I mean? The peanut soup. Yeah, you know what I mean? Yeah. The gold soup is my favorite, you know, mm -hmm. and all those things. Yeah. But, when you come to a country and you're thinking, okay, you're gonna get the same thing, yeah, and you don't not. get it, it's like you're selling the wrong type. Of thing. I hear. It. Yeah. So what? Tell me, what was wrong with the jerk? What What made it not jerk? It. All right. Let me break down a jerk chicken for you. How we do jerk chicken? Mm -hmm. Okay, jerk chicken. You buy your chicken, you wash it, clean it, you know, remove all the air and everything, yeah. nice and ready. You season it with your season, your herbs and your spice. Yeah. We're talking about the scotch bonnet pepper. Pepper, black pepper, peppermint. Mm -hmm. You're using your thyme. You're using pimento leaves. Yeah. You know, you're using all the scallions, onions, garlics, yeah. and all this. Thing. You marinate that with salt and pepper. You marinate that. You leave it to set for maybe two, three days if you want in your, yeah. fr in your, in your fridge. Yeah. Then you got your nice cold stove, mm -hmm. barbecue, as people would say, barbecue. Yeah. And then you grill that. Right. 
Right. But we're not talking about burning it, we're talking about slow cook. <laughs> you know what I mean? Grill that nicely, yeah, yeah, keep yeah. hunting it, turn it, close it, get the smoke into it. See, you can taste the smoke inside uh -huh. your chicken. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get yeah. it nice and juicy and succulent. Then when you're done, you serve that with, you can serve that with ardo bread, you know mm -hmm. what I mean? Or whatever choice of carburetor you want to you wanna add to that. Yeah. You know what I mean? Add some jerk season, a jerk sauce, make mm -hmm. a jerk sauce, pepper sauce. This didn't taste nowhere near oh, really? anything. Do you understand? Right. It just, all it tastes was shit on. That was it. <laughs> you know, you just have chicken with shit on it. Yeah, yeah, you know yeah, what I mean? Yeah. And, and, yeah. And, and that was disappointing. You, right, you understand? Okay. So, you know, that's the difference between getting it originally from Jamaica, done in Jamaica, uh -huh. and done in Ghana. So, you know. Okay. So, in the UK, have they mastered the jerk chicken? Some places. Right, okay. Some places. Because now you're making me think that maybe I haven't had jerk chicken before. Yeah. Maybe I, I need to have the it. original one. I will have to come and prepare some, and then you, yeah. can, and then you can understand. Yeah, you know, yeah. in the UK, all right. If you if you're born in Jamaica, born born in Jamaica, yeah. and raised there, then you have an idea of how to do it properly. Yeah. But if you're a descendant of a Jamaican mm. and your thought is okay, putting a chicken on a grill, turn it two time, and yeah. then that's jerk chicken, then that salt and pepper on it, yeah. and then you think that it's jerk. That's not jerk chicken. Okay. That's just putting a chicken in the grill. You know? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Can I you explain the process? Because you've got, remember that embarrassing time where yes. they were speaking about jerk rice. Yeah. Why can you not have jerk rice? This is a big thing. Because um, the process of jerk is not the seasoning. Oh, okay. It's not just the seasoning. Oh. The seasoning is what you use to marinate it, to give it that wonderful taste. Yeah. The jerk is the process of the grill, the charcoal grill. The smoke, the pimento leaf. Right. You can even go as far as putting beer, red striped beer, while the jerk you just sprinkle some red striped beer on top of it, give it that nice yeah. good essence. It's a, it's a slow process. It's a slow wow. process on a cold grill. Close down, shut, yeah. let it marinate, let it steam. Yes. Open it, flip, turn, mm. steam. So, okay. so I'm, that's I'm, what I'm, it is. I'm getting you. So it's similar yeah. to someone that says, I make pizzas and they have the deep oven, yeah. and those that are doing it. In a normal oven, like yeah. it's not quite it's, the it's same. It's not thing. quite the same. Right. Yeah, you don't go to the Italia, yeah. it, Italy, and then you say you want pizza, yeah. and you just chuck it in the oven. No, yeah. it has a special built place yeah, that's that designed done. for the process. Right. And that's what it is—a process. Right. So you can't ever have jerk rice, but you can't put a rice in a grill. Yeah, 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 yeah. You understand? Okay. But yeah. Okay. So, what about your? Because you call it brown stew chicken, right? Yeah. What is? What's the difference between brown stew chicken and normal stew? It's not you the know same what? thing. It's, it's, it's literally almost the same. It's just basically the sauce is brown. It's a brown sauce. So you have to buy that or can you make it? You can make your own browning, brown, brown in, which is like sh like sugar, yeah. caramelized sugar in the pot, in the dirty pot. Just put it in there and like, get it almost burnt. And that's uh, the brown. Then you can put your chicken in it and then you start and it start giving you that brown dark color. Uh, or you buy browning from the shop. You know what I mean? All this is. talk about food is making me so hungry. <laughs> this is the wrong time to do this video because it is dinner time, trust me. I'm yeah. so hungry. Yeah. <laughs> I could do with some of that. Oh, and I really want some patties. I love patties so yeah. much. It's like in Ghana, you can't find patties. You find meat pies, yeah. but not patties. I'm like, I want a patty, a good patty. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. Yeah, you have to make me some before you leave. So, <laughs> yeah, I will have to do that. Yeah. Okay. Madame is giving me instructions for buying the camera. She said, what's curry goats? Yeah. Uh huh. Tell me. I find lots of people are saying, is it goat, is it lamb, is it mutton, what is it? Uh -huh. Can you explain? Can I explain? Why am I putting that? Get, get, yeah. get being put on the you spot. You said you're the chef. Oh, jeez. Yeah. <laughs> I love Ghana, isn't it? That is so nice. <laughs> yeah. Oh, jeez. Goat is goat. Yeah. Sheep is sheep. You know what I mean? Lamb is lamb. Yeah. You know, and for goat, when you do a curry, is curry goat. Right. We use goats in Jamaica right. to make curry goat. We don't use lamb. Mm -hmm. We don't use um, I said sheep. Yeah. Sheep, right? We don't use sheep. Okay. Yeah. Sheep. So curry goat. So is goat is curry actually goat. goat. Is the right. goat? You know. Okay. I, I'm, I'm assuming when you go to a Ghanaian restaurant and you add a goat soup. Yeah. It's goat. Yeah. It's not lamb. Yeah, yeah, yeah Or yeah, sheep yeah. or whatever. Yeah. You know well, what I mean? It yeah. shouldn't be. It shouldn't be. It yeah, should yeah. be. Yeah, you understand. You it, yeah. So when you hear the, the when we say J Jamaica say curry goat, it has to be curry goat. It cannot be right. curry anything. Else. Okay. You know what I mean? Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, authentic. Are there places for like children to play and stuff like that? Because I find that in Ghana, a lot of the things that are around are not built for children. Like, so we don't have like a lot of parks. I mean, there are some, but we don't have a lot of parks. 
like life is not really catered towards children. Is it like that in Jamaica? Same. It's the same. It's the same. You know, I don't because I'm so old right now. You know, what I mean, so very old. You know. Yeah, because I, I see all your grey hair. You can it's see them. You know, what I mean, old, popping so. up. Uh, so uh -huh. when we growing up in Jamaica, as a youth, we didn't. I don't think anyone ever thought about creating a park yeah. for kids to play. Mm. We create our own park. Okay. We take the forest or the river, <laughs> we climb the trees, uh -huh. you know, we go to, you know, and, and that's our playground. Right. And even now, you know, since I visited there the last time, I can't see any building or any structure that's up mm. to say that's where kids can go park, go play. Oh. The country is trained. Yeah. I think even for Ghana, like now, I notice the beaches are not free. Yeah. Same yeah. thing in Jamaica. Before you could go to a beach yeah. and go swim all day, cook a meal and yeah. have, have a family day. Mm -hmm. Now if you go to a beach, you have to pay to go into the beach. You understand? Yeah. And that is the same because I love the beach, yeah, you know, yeah, next you door and all yeah. these beaches from from you gotta it's somebody so Ghana is selling out the beach and Jamaica is selling out the beaches. Right. That's what it is. Yeah. Okay. So that's a similarity with the same with the country, both countries. Mm. Yeah. Okay. So I'm gonna ask you this question. Now yeah. you might be a bit torn here, right? Yeah. Where would you prefer to live, Ghana or Jamaica? <laughs> <Good Yeah. question. laughs> All right, right no, now. We're not, we're not, we're not, you know, we're not, you're not selling out. We're just, no. you know, we're like. This is, not, this is not even a trick question. <laughs> okay. My mind has been made up since 2002, since the first time I came to Ghana. Uh huh. Ghana. Ghana. Yeah. Why? That's amazing. Ghana. Why? Straight up. Straight Why? up. Why? I, I, I felt a connection here. Okay. okay. When I used to travel from Jamaica to abroad, to other countries, America, wherever, I would go there and I know I'm in a foreign land. Wow. I feel like I'm in a foreign land. Yeah. When I came to Ghana for the first time, mm. I knew I was home. Wow. Do you understand? I felt like there was a part of me that was left behind and I've just connected to it. Mm. I didn't want to go back, I was crying. I was like, I'm not going. I said, I'm not going back to the UK. I'm, I'm staying. I'm staying. I'm staying. Yeah. But I had to go back to where I live. Yeah. But like now, with it, me making the decision right now, Ghana is the place. Really? But why yeah. not Jamaica? No, no, I love Jamaica. Yeah. I, I, love I know Jamaica. you love. I, love I, I know you love Jamaica. I, yeah. I love Jamaica yeah. more than you can imagine. But yeah. for me, as I said, Jamaica has changed. Right. Jamaica has changed a lot. With Ghana is a bigger country. Compare, compared to Ghana to Jamaica, Jamaica is like that and Ghana is like that. Right. You know, and um, with Ghana is still a developing country and, and I think that there's so much opportunities out here. Plus I feel comfortable. Mm. I feel comfortable. Jamaica, I feel comfortable. Yeah. Still doing stuff out there, but for me I prefer to be in Africa more than the Caribbean at all. Wow. Yeah. That's yeah, that's how I feel. But I will keep going. Because okay. I love going out there. Yeah, yeah, I have so yeah. much of fun course. when I go to Jamaica. I know, need to so. go. I've never been to Jamaica before and I feel like I'm missing out. Like, I no, need you to, are missing I, out. I need to go. No, you I are missing to. out. Listen, you are missing out. I can tell you, if you go to Jamaica, you will not disappoint. Be disappointed. Right. Go with someone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't go by yourself. Mm. You know, book a nice hotel package, all inclusive, yeah. where you can, you know what I mean, you don't have to worry about cooking, breakfast, yeah, lunch, yeah, or dinner, yeah, eat yeah, as they yeah, choose. Yeah. And go with someone who knows Jamaica. Mm -hmm. You will find some lovely spots. Let me tell you, you will have so much fun. Okay. Yeah, you know what I mean. You will like, oh geez, I can't wait to go back again next summer. Yeah. You understand? Okay. Because we got events after events mm. after events after events yeah. constantly. Okay, so if I go to Jamaica on my own, like, will I get kidnapped? No, that's never. the thing. That's the thing that people think, right? If you go to Jamaica, you get kidnapped. Will I get kidnapped? No. You just no. have to be street no, smart, no. right? Listen. It's like same as here, yeah. Polite as as as. They would say, man has brought you through the world. Mm -hmm. There's no point being disrespectful because you're from foreign. Yeah. Jamaica yeah. is a foreign country because if it wasn't, you wouldn't be going there. Yeah. Right? Yeah. So don't be disrespectful. You know what mm -hmm. I mean? Be polite to people. You can, and you will see people, they will help to, they will, to be honest, let me say this. If you go to Jamaica, the moment you land, you will get a tourist guide, a tour guide <laughs> immediately. Yeah. Where you, where you go? Come and take your own man. Yo, oh. where you stay? I'm never caring up. That's how it is, and they will want to take you everywhere. Yes, you're gonna be their sponsor. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you're gonna be their sponsor. <laughs> but that's the same as but, here. Yeah. But they will make sure you have a good time. They will right. take you to places right. and show you the spot that the hotel won't show you. Right. You understand? Right. And that's okay. what it is. Okay, that makes sense. Yeah. I, I'm, I'm gonna be going to Jamaica soon, guys. Watch. Watch yes. this space. Of course. Yeah. Of course. Of course. <laughs>
Okay, so just before we go, yeah. can you tell me, like, because in Ghana, like, the children, they play certain games. Mm -hmm. So we have, like, Ampe and things like that. What is it, like, give me one traditional game that you play in Jamaica. Wow. Do you know any? Marbles. <laughs> we play marbles. Okay, marbles. We play marbles. There's a lot of games. I know they do it in Ghana also. You know where you get the tire? Yes. We you, we play the tires too. Oh, you we do play that with too. the tires, we push that tire yeah, rolling yeah, yeah, behind yeah, the tires. Yeah, 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 yeah. You understand? We play gig, you know, we play marble, we play upscotch, okay. which is it, you know, the jump, yeah, jump, jump. Yeah, yeah. You know, plus we love the river. I think as a child our main playground was in the rivers. Really? So yeah. you play in the water? Yeah, we go in the water, we fill so our own little pools. I think, pools I think and that's swim. the difference, you know, yeah. because in Ghana, even though we have beaches here, yeah. a lot of the children, they do go into the water sometimes, but a lot of them don't know how to oh, swim, swim, so ah. they don't necessarily go to the water. Okay. I think because um, there's rivers, but you don't really have a lot of rivers running through, really. Yeah. But like in Jamaica, we got so many rivers. Ah. You understand? So, so most many people rivers. Can swim. Most people can swim. I mean, I would say nearly 99% of the people in Jamaica really? can swim. There's people out there who can't swim, don't get me wrong. Yeah. But there's, we all, you have to learn. Your bigger uh, brother will throw you in the water, go and learn to swim. <laughs> if they see you look, drown in, they come and help you. do that to me, man. Oh. <laughs> no, it's, it's, it's yeah, yeah, we yeah. do these things. Yeah, yeah, and that yeah. makes you become braver and, you know, you want to be like your siblings or your older yeah, friends. Yeah. You know, that's how, that's how I learned. Okay. So what about the school system? Yeah. So, what, is, it, is it like, the schools look the same as here? Yeah. Okay. Uniform, we same uniform, khaki uniform, blue, oh, really? purple, red, green, yeah, different schools. Same, same, same thing. Same thing. You know? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Madame, great. you're gonna say something? Yeah, I was gonna say I actually envy his childhood. Really? Because he's downplaying it right now. Uh -huh. but the rivers, he used to get a banana leaf, like they they're so creative. <laughs> a banana leaf uh -huh. at the top of the hill, sit on that banana leaf and slide down the hill. Into really? the water. If his parents knew, uh -huh. he'd be in a lot of trouble. Okay. But then it was who could get, you know, a stone from the bottom to prove that they've wow. gone dived right down to the bottom. Really hey. crazy stuff. It's, it's crazy. I just say, wow. as she's saying, I'm done playing. I can't say everything, yeah, but yeah, yeah, yeah. we have fun. You know, mm. that's the only thing I'm thinking. I, like, for, I see a lot of kids in Ghana. I don't know what it's like for them, fun wise, what yeah. they do for fun. Yeah. I don't know where they have a specific place to go, hang out mm. with their friends, or uh, what kind of games they play, or uh, stuff like that. But I know for me, as a, growing up as a child, we have so much fun. We create everything. Mm. We make our own cricket ball, bats, our own cricket balls, you know wow. what I mean? We play races down the hill, as she's saying. Yeah. Sitting on coconut tree limbs, <laughs> going sailing. <laughs> bro if I go home, I let my father, sometimes my, my hips are bruised, yeah. red. <laughs> you can't tell your parents, but that's how we have fun. Yeah, 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 you know yeah. what I mean? We yeah. go to the deepest, Deepest reservoir and, and, and going in it. Wow. Knowing the fact that, that, yeah. that, that mark on his nose. <laughs> uh -huh. That's 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 what that's, that's one from there. childhood, that's, that, right? That, that, yeah, that's a butter scar. Uh -huh. <laughs> Ghana is a beautiful place. Uh -huh. You know, I would recommend it to anyone in the world. There's a difference I noticed. I was uh -huh. just thinking about the hotels. Hotel in Ghana, before you book a hotel, I would say get someone to recommend the hotel for you. Yeah. And yeah. One of the things I wish Ghana had was all-inclusive service in hotels. I don't know if it, yeah. it exists, or maybe where I'm staying is different, but mm. all-inclusive service in a hotel would be ideal. Yeah. You know what I mean? That would just cut down some of the worry. Yeah, yeah. You know, and then so you can just have a free like yeah. holiday, free, free holiday, your mind, exactly. Right? Yeah, because yeah. you know, okay, I'm gonna come, have my dinner, my yeah. breakfast, and yeah. then you say I'm gonna go. Yeah. You know, instead of have to be keep constantly mm. buying food and you know trying to cook yeah. some time. But yeah, 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 yeah. So okay. that's what it is. So you, you, you have that passion for Ghana now, right? I am a Ghanaian. It's a Ghanaian. I am a Ghanaian. See what I mean? <laughs> I, am a, I, am a, I have a word I used to say, but I'm not going to use that. So I'm a Ghanaian and I'm Jamaican. So uh -huh. I'm a Ghana Jamaican boy. Yes, <laughs> that's right. Why not? That's yeah, right. Yeah, 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 and that's... you don't need visa, do you, to go to between Ghana and Jamaica? No, do we you? don't. We don't. We don't. Wow. Because um, so, so the you return, the year of the return or something like that. Yeah. Is it, is, that's what it's called. Year of return, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so for me, I just turn up with my, my Jamaican passport and say, yeah. Uh -huh. Meanwhile, somebody had to go get visa. Yeah, I'm I know, right? Not looking at anybody. Yeah. Right? Yeah. That's what that was. Get visa. <laughs> but you know, so but I, used to, I used to get visa too. I used to have to have a uh -huh. visa. Uh -huh. Yeah, but then, you know what I mean? I realized my privileges. Yeah, So I, I have it, dumped right? that one. Yes. That one over there. So let me take back this one and start working with this that's one. That's it, that's it. Yeah. Oh, tell, awesome. tell us about the meaning of Jamaica. The meaning? Of the name, remember? Mommy told us. Oh, I don't know. It's, <laughs> Mommy's not here. 
I can't remember. Oh, 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 a chummy guami. Okay, so interestingly enough, very recently I discovered that the word Jamaica is actually derived from the tree language and it's pronounced Jama Yaka, meaning perhaps we are stuck. The term is um, referred in that way because people came that were captured in slave during slavery times were taken to a foreign land and they thought we are stuck. And so in the language it translated to be Jama Yaka Jamaica, which we now know it as. Very, very interesting. Well, Scott, <laughs> thank you so much for talking to me. Yes. Honestly, yes. I don't know how much editing I can do this video. This video is going to be long. I don't want to keep it long because uh, there's, uh, there's nothing I can cut out from this video because this video, and honestly, was so interesting. Thank it you is. so much for talking to me. Listen, it's a pleasure. And please, Support the thing, you understand me? Uh, Support the thing. Don't run with the thing, you know? Hold on, let me, let me do that. Hold on, let me, let me put my Jamaican accent on. Hold yeah, on. go on, huh? Okay. Now, support the thing, Naman. Okay? Um, um, <laughs> why are you not move up? Can you do better? Ha, ah, go on then. Support the thing, Naman. Subscribe. Like the thing. Share the thing. You know the thing, bro. Yeah, man. Ah. There you go. You Ooh. see it? Everything, everything up. Everything up. Ah. Everything up. <laughs> I tried, I felt guys, don't worry. No, no, you did good, you did good. You, you do better, you did better than most people. Okay. You know what I mean? Trust me, you did well. Yeah. <laughs> what you gotta do, forget your accent. Uh-huh. Forget your grammar. Forget your English job. Throw it, lesson. throw it out the way. Throw all what the teacher yeah, yeah, taught yeah, yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then just say, you know, you're gonna freestyle. Uh -huh. Just it's it's a it's a pigeon. You right. break everything in short words. Uh-huh. You see me? I get you. You see me. Me see you. You see me. See. Say you say you see me. You see me. See? You see me. You did it. There you go. Yeah. I did it, guys. You see? <laughs> Jamaica. Yeah, Converted. Converted. <laughs> She's now a Jamaican Ghani. <laughs> I am. So, guys, if you haven't already subscribed, please do me a favor. Hit the subscribe button for me. Hit the notification bell. Also, don't forget to do me a favor and like, comment, and definitely share this video for me. Until next time, I am out. Mm -hmm. <laughs>